Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm going to be teaching you how to draw a kraken, which is like a bigger type of octopus if you didn't know what it is. Um, I'm going to draw a kraken with a pirate ship above it on water. I'm going to be showing you guys how to draw it. So first thing we need a piece of paper. Once you get a piece of paper, draw a line like what I did. You probably start with pencil first, because I might mess up too. Then what you're gonna do, you gotta do a line like this. And you're gonna come around all the way like that. Now what you're gonna do is this. Come back around like this. If you want to, you can kind of erase it right here. And then you can kind of see the difference of like right here it connects the right way. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna do the same thing for eight of them. Sorry, my cat is crazy and she comes in the camera. Or you can do more if you want, but I just do eight. So once you do that, I just did mine like this. If you want to copy mine. Then what you're going to do is I'm going to start drawing the eyes. For the first eye, you're probably going to do this. Then you're just gonna do the same, actually. You gotta do this. Make it look kind of more realistic. Then you're gonna do the same exact thing on the other eye. Like this. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna do something like this on both of the eyes. I didn't really do it on both of the eyes. Cause I just have to show you this. So now I did on both eyes. Once you do that, what you're gonna do is you're going to do like this. Then you're gonna do this. Actually, you can erase that. One mistake made. You can erase the little, the little pimples. I don't know. The thing that I put in the eyes. Sorry, my cat. 
Then you're just gonna put two lines, like this. It's mostly just like this. Then you're just gonna draw like circles around it, or like on it, I mean. Okay, stop. Mostly like this. I know it doesn't really look, I know I didn't put that much circles on it, but it's supposed to kind of look like that. And then you do this. Just erase that circle that's in the middle of those. It doesn't really look that cool. And then draw it like over on the side. I put that. Well, now you're done with the crack and hold on. Psst, Pogo, stop. Now you're gonna have a, there's gonna be a pirate ship actually. There's gonna be a pirate ship on the top and then there's gonna be a pirate ship on like a sunken ship. Never mind, I'm making a lot of mistakes. There's just gonna be, we're gonna draw the eye out of the island. So you're just gonna draw like an island like so that. Then you're gonna draw a palm tree. So once you do that, you're gonna draw a treasure chest. Sorry, something's cooking back. So you might hear that weird noise. And then once you draw the pirate ship, or not the pirate ship, the treasure, that's what you do. Buy the palm tree. If you want, I'm probably good to do it. Never mind. I was gonna draw a dock. But what, now we're gonna start on the pirate ship. So here's the outline of the pirate ship. Mine's not really perfectly straight, so I might make the water a little taller. Like bigger, I mean. Just press really light. You can't really see it like I did. So once you do the pirate ship outline, and if yours is like perfect connected to the ground, we do that. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna draw the cannons. There's gonna be a bunch of cannons. Actually, hold on. Kind of looks too small. We're gonna draw windows. Like this. I'm drawing the stairs up to like where the captain place is, the pirate captain.
If you want, you can make it kind of 3D like I'm doing. I'll show you guys in a second. So you can be like this. There's the stairs. Like that. You can kind of be a little 3D. And then you can draw the door in the middle. Like that. Then you're going to connect it like that. And then what you're going to do is you're going to draw a window like this. Like, like there. Actually, you can make the stairs kind of bigger. So, erase all of that mess. Sorry. I make mistakes. So like this, probably do, and then connect it again. Draw a bigger door, and then draw a window again like this. Then you're gonna do a line like boom, and down sorry then once you do that you're gonna draw two windows like this and then you're gonna draw the little fencing Like I did. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna draw this little cir circling in the fencing like that. Then you're gonna draw these two lines and like go up and curve and like kind of make it like a circle shape. Then you're gonna use, actually you're gonna do this little line poking out of it like that. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna draw a circle. Hold on. Like that. Then you're gonna draw these lines on it. Cause now it's gonna be the steering wheel. Like that. Then you're gonna draw this big, tall line. And we're gonna go over a bit and go down like this. And then you're gonna raise two little lines into it. And go like, hold on. And then go like this. 
Don't draw the two little squares at the end. I mistake that I made it a little bit long, so I erased it. Then once you do that, you're gonna draw. something like this. Then you're gonna put lines through it. Like this. So now we're done with the pirate ships. The pirate ship. We're not fully done with the paper yet, though. We still have to color it and add one more thing. We gotta add pirates. We can add, I guess, some, like, hold on. Or you can draw one pirate if you want to. Paco, hold on. Alright, if you hear a weird noise, it's some, it's us cooking, my family cooking, and my cat making weird noises. I'm probably just drawing the only, just one pirate, the captain. Cause I don't, uh, maybe two. So what you're gonna do is like this for his body. I know he looks kind of big, but this is kind of like a cartoony thing. Don't want to it to scare anyone. Or it can be just really far away, <clears throat> and he's standing like really close. You can do that too. So once you do that, you're gonna erase a little bit of his arms on top. Then you're going to go down for his hands. But we're only drawing one normal hand because he has a fake hand. Like this. Then once you do that, what you can do is you can do this. Then once you do that, you gotta do this little stitch because his clothes are ripped. Then you're gonna do these two little lines. You can just leave those two little lines blank and I'll show you what it is whenever we're coloring it. Then you're gonna draw these two little lines on the dude, just like to be like a rope, I guess you can call it. And then you're gonna draw this line a little bit over the two little lines he did in the body. Cause now we're drawing his like um, rope around him or like his sword case. It 
it's empty because the it's empty like this because he's gonna be holding it in his hand. Like this. But you're gonna add one more thing to that, to the sword, like this. Draw the head a little small, about like this. Big head, small body, I know it's weird. Then you're gonna draw the mouth. Like this. The reason that, why that little dot there is because we're gonna draw the beard next. The beard, not beard. You can just draw like a line around it. Or it can actually just press hard on your pencil. Have a sharpener around because if it it might break. It can be like this. So you can still see the mouth. Once you do that, you're gonna draw the eyes on him. I know he kinda looks like a zombie, but He's not, he just, pirates look weird. You gotta do something like this. So once you do that, you're gonna draw the hat. It's supposed to be a little long. Actually, never mind. Don't copy me. Because I'm going to make a little fix. So, I know it kind of looks like a weird hat, but you'll see whenever I get it. And you're going to make it have long hair. The pirate have, like, long hair. As you know, pirates don't like, they can't shave. So I guess you can make it like this. Ah, uh, you can erase that. Some pirates have short hair. There's gonna be a little bandana on top, so like that. Don't look at the hair. Just don't look at the head. I'll race it more. So once you do the little bandana type of thing on the top, we're drawing a skull on his hat. Like this. So we're done with the captain pirate. We just need to color him. And we're adding another pirate on here. Which is, I know this is a really long video. It's like 24 minutes so far. Once we're going to do that, we're going to do another pirate with like, he's standing on the island. Add something to the pirate ship. I wasn't done with the pirate ship exactly yet. Just add this thing on the top so people can like stand in it. And then add like ladders. Like this. 
now I'm gonna get started on the other pirate. He's a little far away, so um, it's smaller. First, you're gonna draw a circle. Like that. I know it kind of looks like a coconut, but it's not a coconut. Then this dude's gonna have a bandana on like this. And then you can press really light on the top of his head because that's like his hair. Actually, you can erase that. Don't do hair. And then you can do eyes. Like this. Once you do that, you can start drawing his body. He looks a little funny because he's like far away. He has a peg leg too. So you can draw his body and his peg leg. I think it's called, I don't know. You would think I know a lot about pirates, but I really don't. Then you're gonna draw the rest of his like leg, like this. Like he's walking back up. And then what you're gonna draw is this. So you know he has shoes on. So just draw like a little line in the middle of this. We're almost done, I promise. You can color it on your own. I'll color it so you don't have to wait this long on the video. Now we're drawing his hands. He's not having a fake hand. He's not having a hook hand. So there are his hands. Then we're gonna draw this. So it looks like his neck. He's not going to, you're not going to really see his arms. <clears throat> so once you do that, you're going to draw, actually, we're done with the video. Well, thanks for watching. Bye. Well, bye. Have a great rest of your day, month, year, I don't know, bye.